Alright, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to get uh, NES ROMs on your iPhone and iPod Touch without uh, your computer. You just add a source and installer. And this source, I finally, the sor uh, this source is finally up and working again. I don't know if it was ever down. I'm pretty sure it was, but anyways, let's get onto it. Alright, go to installer. And I have another tutorial for this, just if you want to do it that way. And that gives you a lot more ROMs that you can get. Alright, you need to go to sources, edit, add, and then the source is uh, 123 locker, L O C K E R. Locker. Locker.com. 123locker.com. I'm just going to hit cancel because I've already put it in. Alright, then your sources are refresh. <coughs> hit done. And then go to install and then go to games okay let's see I've already installed it so all right and then hit hang on one second NES ROMs you should see NES ROMs under games and if it's not under games just go to all packages and look for it it's version 1.1.1 or 1.20 just hit over and then install that it's a 5.9 megabyte file and I do have Wi-Fi now and it still took a long time well not a really long time but a few minutes because it's a big file okay and then once you get done installing that it'll take you back to all packages go to home hit the home button it will refresh go ahead to unlock your home Go over, or go to NES, open it up, and you should see all your games you just put on there. And that's it. If you're having any problems, just leave a comment or anything. And if the source, if it's not showing up under sources, just go to all packages. But if the source is going under uncategorized, you need to. Uh, well, actually, I think the source comes up under uncategorized. But if it's not working. Just try to refresh sources again, and don't let it go into the sleep mode or whatever, but thanks for watching, and please subscribe.